Many developers in the Java world will recall the major impact that resulted from the remote code execution, or RCE flaw, in the Log4j code from a number of months ago. At this year's Java 1 event in Las Vegas, Open Refactory's founder, Dr. Munawar Hafiz, planned to present a talk on Log4Shell, where were your bug detection tools, to highlight why the mainstream static analysis tools all failed to find the flaw. Open Refactory's Intelligent Code Repair, or ICR, however, was able to detect that flaw, but lightning struck again before he could give his talk. The night before his scheduled talk, he learned about a nearly identical recently reported RCE flaw in Apache's Common Text Toolkit. And once again, all of the other tools failed to discover the flaw. However, ICR was, once again, able to uncover the problem. So, Munawar's talk transformed overnight to highlight this new example of how current tools are failing us. Let's look at how ICR instead was able to uncover the flaw. After connecting to the ICR server and logging in, we locate the Apache library source code, which we have placed in the local file system of the server. We click on the Analyze button to start the analysis. Once it completes, we can look at the result. We know that the reported flaw is an injection problem, and ICR has indeed found one. Let's look at it. ICR reports that it has found a problem where there is an evaluation sync using tainted data. This is exactly the problem that has been reported as the new remote code execution flaw in the library. As we scroll down through the text, we can see how the tainted data passes down through various method calls until it reaches the call to eval when the tainted data could cause remote code execution. ICR has detected this serious problem that was missed by all of the other tools.